demons themselves. But the truth of the matter is that Jesus Christ is one. The truth of the matter is Jesus when he says, I am the way, the truth, and the life. The truth of the matter is that every day you can put on Jesus. Because he didn't stay dead 2,000 years ago. He rose 2,000 years ago. He rose again. Every day you can hear his words. Sanctify them by your truth. Your word Your word is truth. Every day, in every way, we can put on that truth because God's Spirit has touched us and we are alive in Jesus. Last week, uh, when I got home, I, I had to uh, just get a little workout. I, I went to Gold's Gym, and there was a gal there who came to talk to me while I was on the bike. She she has been very kind to Jeff, and, and he has listened to her and been there for a little bit. She's about my age. I'd hate to, if she's younger and she was here, I'd have to apologize, but I think she's about my age, right? And, and uh, she was sharing with me how, um, how she came out of a tradition, a Christian tradition, that really muddied up grace. You know what grace is? That the fact that God smiles down upon me for Jesus' sake, that we don't have to add, have, we don't have to add anything to it. That every single day he's there to forgive us and to love us and to empower us and to be there for us. Not because we do anything, but because he has done everything on the cross. Grace is that undeserved love that we have known in Jesus Christ. That's where grace is. She was brought up in a tradition that kind of muddied that up. And she's just beginning to understand it again. And I looked at her and I smiled and I said, Now it's something when every day we can live in the truth that because of Jesus... God looks down on me and smiles. And His Spirit is with me to share that smile with others. Every day, every way, put on Jesus the belt of truth. Amen. Now may the peace of God which passes all understanding keep your hearts and minds in true faith and life never ending. Amen. We stand, we confess our faith. Um,